time to upgrade this even further. Um, going from two four gig sticks, which are I am going to keep. 24 gigs total dual channel mode with some Corsair Vengeance LPX memory DDR4 2400 megahertz which is what that is um CL16 which is what <clears throat> the stalkers are so it's about time to upgrade Then I will have 24 gigs of RAM in total, and it has support of 32. Oh man, look at that. Oh yes. <clears throat> Now it's just a matter of since I already got these flipped, these are solid. Um, just <clears throat> line up like this. Be careful not to break the motherboard while doing this, <clears throat> while everything's still installed in the motherboard. Last stick of RAM. And everything is now good. Um, so, I'm going to cut here for a minute and I'm going to hook everything up. So, I'll be back. Alright, time to see. The fruits of labor. After I turn that on, I forgot to plug it in. <laughs> so I press delete. All right, we go. CPU or memory change? Uh, well, I did change memory, so. It's happily um, reading 24 megabyte, I mean gigabytes of RAM. Not gonna mess with overclocking. Um, Auto, which is set for 2400. So it's happily reading our RAM. And now this is what I want to see. A normal boot menu. And I'll be back as the when it's boot up. Alright, boot it to the desktop. So first thing I'm gonna do is check the task manager. You're making it hard for me to reach over, dude. Come here. Aww, angry dog. Okay, so maybe the computer's still booting up. I mean, after all, I did just add 16 gigs of RAM. There we go. Let's see if it happily picks up 24 gigs on here too. 
Yep. So 24 gigs right there. Now time for CPU ID. Memory. Okay, so currently at 17 cycle clicks. Two, three. Oh, crap. <laughs> Looks like it's, uh, the RAM I got is, uh, clock faster than. Oh. Clock faster than, uh, stalkers. Eh, well. But, let's go ahead and. Um. Bench it. That's awesome. That's pretty cool. So it looks like 1863 for a single thread and 8470 for multi thread. Oh boy. But yeah, so this is it the increased RAM. Why do you even fucking show email with your stupid ass thing? Ugh. Jesus. Yeah, so. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and run some American Truck Simulator. I'll be back. Okay. We're in American Truck Simulator. So, I'm going to go ahead and do a quick job, a short one. Um, okay, let's do this one. It's from Ben to Salim. I do have V-Sync on, so... And right now, we're already seeing over 8 gigs of RAM using um, because of all the other programs that opened up. But, let's go ahead and go. Oop. Before I do anything, i got to turn the master volume down. There we go. Hopefully you guys can see the performance on the screen from uh, we return to statistics using uh, what the hell kind of horse there we go anyway using Reva tuner statistics using uh, with MSI afterburner. So it's about a two and a half hour journey. We got eight hours on the clock. <clears throat> but as you could, if you could see, having that extra 16 gigs already helping in terms of RAM usage. So, 
playing this using a Xbox One controller. Yeah. My kind of truck. Well, not really. I hate the headlights that's on it. Then again, it is a Peterbilt, and I prefer the cameras. So, we're gonna go through this journey on this video, so it gives a good chance to really test out that new RAM. Yeah, here we go. Oh, there's a bit of frame drop. It's because it's starting to rain. Uh, looks like we gotta go that way. But this journey is gonna take us through to Selim anyway, so. Thirty frames. Now, what would happen if I turn V Sync off? Uh, let's see. Well, oh, you're about to find out. So let's go ahead and turn brightness up. <clears throat> With VSync off, we get a massive frame rate improvement. So we're gonna wait for this to load. Yeah. Well. It's no different um, well let's see the settings so okay 1080p entering crank to the max so let's just keep that on so I don't really care about you know, 60 frames per second recording because, you know, well, I would care when I'm not recording, but since I'm recording, uh, just to show that RAM usage, now I got more than enough RAM to play games and do other shit. So, now we're going 55 miles an hour. Let's turn headlights on and see. Wow. We're getting everything now that we got some bad weather. <clears throat> but anyway, this is a video of installing 16 get more, more gigs of RAM in my computer. Thank you guys for watching.